Hi, well, well, of course, Johnson & Johnson's stock has been halted. We're just getting the news. The company um, contracting with an outside um, laboratory to test its baby powder because, remember, on October 18th, the FDA said it had found trace amounts of asbestos in one bottle of Johnson's baby powder, and the company uh, initially or voluntarily recalled uh, that lot from the market. Now, J&J &J is saying that 15 new tests from that same bottle of baby powder previously tested by the FDA finds no asbestos. Additionally, the company saying over 60 new tests of the recalled lot conducted by two third-party laboratories also find no asbestos. Um, so they're saying here in their press release that the tests suggest that positive readouts for asbestos could have been possible due to lab contamination. Now, the FDA, when it put out its release, said uh, it didn't believe there was any sign of cross-contamination. Um, so this affected Johnson & Johnson stock quite a bit, going back to October 18th, more than $20 billion in market value. Uh, we'll see when J&J's stock reopens what it does today, but the company saying two independent laboratories say no asbestos found in that single bottle of baby powder flagged by the FDA. Guys, back to you.